Tubing is used as a conductor when rigid lines are required. It is often easier to assemble and form, and requires no welding to achieve leak-free connections. As with all types of conductors, certain requirements must be met. The line must be large enough to carry the required flow and strong enough to withstand internal pressures. Tubing is measured and specified by its wall thickness and OD outside diameter. Pressure ratings are based on tubing grade and wall thickness. One piece of tubing is joined to another tube connector or component with a tube connector and fastening nut. Often the tube is pre-flared to 37 degrees to accept a 37 degree flare connector. In this learning lab, you will learn proper size selection for a desired flow rate or velocity. To determine the pipe size needed, enter the flow in gallons per minute and the velocity in feet per second in the windows labeled GPM and FPS. You can also use your mouse to slide the red markers on either scale.